Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Ben and Ollie's Deep Pocket Fitches. Yeah. Where are we, Ollie? Open Towers, Nick. Yeah. What have you done now, Dick? Yeah, we're at the ultimate fireworks spectacular for 2023, aren't we? And we've started the vlog down here at Nemesis because on Thursday night, Alton Towers released a video um, precluding to Nemesis breaking out. She killed the phalanx boss, didn't she? <laughs> and then at the end, you saw the big um, Nemesis eye all lit up, all orange. Um, and then when we've come to Alton Towers, all the barriers have been ripped open and the phalanx are guarding it. Um, yeah, it, it really does look incredible. The marketing for this has been so, so good. We were here last night, so we did see fireworks last night and we did also see um, what Nemesis looks like in the dark as well. So we're gonna include that in the vlog later. It looks amazing. So atmospheric around here. Um, all the lights glowing up and the smoke and stuff. Fireworks is amazing as well. So we've got so much to show you in this vlog. And also we've got the VIP Big Bang upgrade, haven't yeah. we? So we're gonna show you what, what that's all about. Um, we get um, a buffet and I think you get fast tracks and you get a um, special viewing area as well. So yeah, so that's gonna be interesting. So we'll include everything about that as well. Um, so yeah, come with us guys. Let's go Alton Towers Fireworks 2023. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, now all the songs are like sitting back with a vengeance. 2024, sign up now. We've got all the phalanx out here, look. Good morning. They're not looking very happy because they've uh, let the beast escape. It's not good. Is she still contained? taking no further questions at this time. Uh-oh. No further questions. Okay. Now goes the monorail. So yeah, that's what it looks like in the daytime. When we come back later, like we did last night, it's going to be really atmospheric, all the smoke and the lights and stuff. Really cool. But yeah, the phalanx aren't taking any questions. Their boss is dead. He got pulled in, didn't he, in the video. <laughs> yeah, and it looks like Nemesis ate him. If you saw our Alton Towers vlog from last week, the Scarefest one, we did ride Funk and Fly, didn't we, Holly? And we thought that might be our last time to ride Funk and Fly, but we may get another opportunity today or tomorrow even. So, yeah, maybe we'll get some another ride on Funk and Fly. So we did quite enjoy it, didn't we? But yeah, last last year of the Retro Squad, so they're going to be gone next year. I wonder what we could see there. Could we see Ripsaw back next year? <laughs> you never saw Ripsaw, did you? No. You know what it is, though, don't you? Because you played it on Virtual Towers. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, but there's no way you can get on it. You can, no, you can. Wow. You can. We just, we just messed up when we did the video. You definitely can. I figured it out. So we've come to the hospitality suite, haven't we? To just check in for our big bang. Just looking through the window, it looks cool, doesn't it? Have you seen all the tables and stuff through there? Hey, Holly, this is cool, isn't it? The hospitality suite. So we're table number forty and get lots of treats. Hey. We've got these guys on our table as well. Happy Steve's date. actually on that table. Steve's on that table, but he's an imposter. I'm an imposter. <laughs> got the Joneses over there. Yeah, this is very nice, isn't it? <laughs> and Paris and Dan are over there, look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're all spread out. So, we've got the fireworks bags, so you get ponchos. 
So oh, so you get kids one. Oh, Ooh, what's the Christmas tickets? Oh, drinks voucher. I don't know if you get a beer. Oh, so you get gold fast tracks. So you get six gold fast tracks. Six ponchos. Big bang guest. Ooh. Oh, so you get the whole agenda on the back of there as well. What does that say? So that just tells you everything that you do in the day. So there's a buffet. You get coffee and stuff over there. Coffee and tea. There's all breakfast stuff over there. The lanyard's got the schedule on the back, Mark. We're going to need the ponchos today as well, aren't we? Because it's miserable out there. Yeah, so we all have to wear them. You have to wear it all day. There should be six in there. Steve's got his from his bag. He's, he's just not wearing it. Well, it's quite big. <laughs> it is big. And you get a photo pass as well. So, yeah. Yeah, it's really good. So here we go then, Holly. This is the agenda for the day that's on the back of the lanyard. So you've got hot drinks and cordials all day in here. And then you've got two drinks vouchers per person. So you get a beer or... Do you want a beer? No. No. So you get a bottle of pop. Then from 4.30 to 6pm, you get a two-course buffet. So that'd be cool. It is better quality, isn't it? Yeah. Although it's a bit shaky. And then it says, it's from 6.40. One of the team will escort you to the fireworks viewing area. It says the venue must be vacated between 6.40 and 8pm. All guests will be required to exit the venue. At 7pm the fireworks start. 7.25 the fireworks finishes. And then you can join the other guests on park. And then 8pm return. Yeah. So you're, free, you're then free to join other guests on park. Then 10 p.m. the venue closes and have a safe journey home. Yeah, so that's our agenda for the day. Are you excited? Should we go and go on some rides? Because we've got fast tracks. We may as well go and get on some rides, haven't we? Or are you just going to stay in here and eat chocolate all day? Sweets. <laughs> and sweets, yeah, you've got lots of sweets. Mummy's got a coffee. Like it, dude? He's already got a pocket full of sweets. So yeah, as well as all the goodies in the bag, you get all these little pastries and stuff. So we've got pan chocolate, oh yeah, look at that. Cinnamon swirl, some muffins, and then some fruits, some bananas and apples. Nutella, Holly, you like your Nutella, don't you? Bread. Yeah. Up there, yeah. There's no bread. It's cool, isn't it? Yeah, this is really nice. You get all this stuff. Oh, you got hot drinks over here, free coffee, juice. Sweets, yeah. Sweetie. Flapjacks. Oh, crikey, there's loads of stuff. Yeah, so you also get um, a drinks voucher, and that can be exchanged for a beer, wine, or obviously a bottle of pop or something, if that's what you fancy. Yeah. So cool. So that was cool, wasn't it? So we just spent uh, about an hour in the hospitality yeah. suite. We've had lots of cakes and sweets and had coffee and juice and I stuff. I had sweets and some black currant juice and some orange. Yeah, that was cool. Um, there's a huge group of us. I'm going to sit the camera up. You probably can't see, but there is loads. I don't even know our group size. It's probably about a bit of rain on my lens. We've got the Ninja Turtles. Yeah, Mike and Stacey have got the Ninja Turtles hats on, haven't they? So yeah, we're yes. going to go over to Spinball first, aren't we? Because a lot of rides look like they're closed. I don't know if it's because of the weather. We've got our lovely ponchos on that were free with the Big Bang thing as well. So yeah, massive, massive thanks to Lee and Ted for arranging this. It's incredible. Um, so it's going to be a real nice experience, isn't it, today? Especially having fast track at fireworks, because fireworks is notoriously busy. So yeah, come with us, guys. Spinball wizard. Yeah. So yeah, we've just counted our group size and we're actually a group of 36, which is going to be interesting when we get to the front of the queue and tell them that.
goes up. Oh, no, you got Eddie. It was very spinny, wasn't it? Was there only you two in there? Yeah. Yeah. I rode with the bears and there was three of us in the car. We got lots and lots of spins as yeah. well. Hell of a lot of spins. Yeah, I thought it was a really good ride on Spinball, to be honest. Really good fun. I don't know if it helped because it's wet as well. But yeah, they're only loading threes at the moment, I think, they said because of the weather. So yeah, they're only loading the trains in threes. But yeah, I think you get better spins anyway. It's really good. So we're just doing a lovely ride on Spinball. So where we're heading now? You can hear the music. Going on Smiley, yeah. Just been saying to Dan, we've had some really nice rides on this recently, haven't we? Comfortable and Smiley don't normally go together, but yeah, the last couple of rides we've had have been decent, haven't they? Been all right. And um, I think they were night rides, so maybe because it had been running all day, maybe that helps. But yeah, let's go on Smiler and see what it's riding like in the rain. Let's go. Yes, that's never happened before. Join us. It was good. Yeah. yeah, it was good, wasn't it? We filled the train as well. Filled the train. But yeah, I've got a newfound love for the smiler, to be honest. It is riding okay. Still a little bit rough towards the end, but it was okay, wasn't it? Yeah. It was okay. I think it rides better in the rain, to be honest. It slaps your face a little bit, doesn't it? But yeah, it was okay. So what are we going on now? Spin Jam. Spin Jam, yeah. This will be the last ever time on Spin Jam, I think. The spin Jam is going. Yeah. Are you sad about that? a little bit sad about spin jam i just wish they'd have themed it up and made it a permanent permanent flat to be honest out of all the retro squad this is my favorite i wish they just won a more intense cycle on it though, to be honest but yeah spin jam good ride on spin jam yeah I think it was quite an intense cycle for a bit. Got a longer intense bit, didn't we? I had no shoes on. Grace took her shoes off. They were on the house. Oh, your socks? Are they wet? Yes. I, <laughs> I knew they would be. That was a bad idea, mate, taking know. your shoes off. Yeah. But no, I think they ran quite a, quite an intense cycle, to be honest. Maybe they're going a bit rogue because it's uh, going at the end of the season. So yeah, only two days left of spin down. So we've come back to the hospitality tent, haven't we, Holly? Because we were a bit cold and wet out there, weren't we? And I tell you something, when you walk in here, it's lovely and warm, isn't it? Feel my hat. Are they cold? No, they're warm now. They're warm. Here's a look at the lawns, pre fireworks. Well, yeah, exactly. What lawns? Yeah. <laughs> See how they put all the hard flooring down so it doesn't get muddy. Although Holly did manage to slip over last night, didn't you, Holly? On the mud over here and got covered in mud. I think it was down there. Yeah, over there where all the ducks are. No, down there. Oh, is it down there? Yeah. So yeah, Holly did fall over last night and uh, got very, very muddy. Oh, there's a big crow there, look. Hello, mate. He looks a bit lost. Oh. Oh, dude. Holly, I think the crows come from Alton Manor. He's a bit lost. <laughs> so yeah, you've got the usual, usual food chucks in. Oh. <laughs> stuck in his bond, yeah. <laughs> He's got his own pri private pond. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, they've got the old bus bar, some churros, noodle bar. And they've got some stuff over there as well. Burger shack, fish yeah. and chips. So yeah. Last night it was really packed here, wasn't it? After fireworks. And they put the one-way system in, so yeah, it's probably going to be like that tonight. But we'll probably avoid all of that because we've got this different viewing area tonight. But yeah, last night we were stood on the centre of the lawns down there. Look at all the ducks. Yeah, lots of ducks. I did see when the fireworks were going off last night. I did see some ducks flying away. I felt a bit sorry for them, to be honest. I saw a, a bird when it just started. I saw a bird flying. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I felt a bit sorry for them because. They, you know, they must get quite scared when all them fireworks start going off on their lake. 
because they're all just sitting there on the lake and all of a sudden all them fireworks start going on. So where are we heading to now? We're going to the rapids. I think the rest of our group's over there waiting for us. The group of 36 people. 30? There's 36 in our whole group today. Yeah. It's crazy. Do you feel a bit sad that towers is closing? Huh? I feel a bit sad. It's a bit emotional, isn't it? I was a bit emotional last night when the fireworks were going on. So it's just the realisation that the season's over, isn't it? Sad that there's no fourth part. Yeah, no fourth part, no open towers. Chessington's still open over the winter, so we are going to go there, aren't we? Um, but then when the new season opens, we've got Nemesis, Hyperia, we've got all them rides to look forward to, so yeah, well, 2024 Hyperia, is going to be exciting. Hyperia will be open, Hyperia will probably open a little bit later. They've said spring, haven't they, for Hyperia, so it will be a bit later, I think, but yeah, it's very exciting. Next 2024 is very exciting. Are you ready to get wet on the rapids? Yeah. Monet's just said the waterfalls are giving it extra, so you might get soaked. Yeah. And Mummy's not very happy. Yeah. Mummy don't want to get a wet bum. <laughs> We're already soaked. Was your ride on Galactica? Have they just leaked the IP? They said it was thank, thank you for flying with Jet2.com. Do you think that's going to be the next IP for, the, for Galactica next year? <laughs> Come back and it's themed to Jet2. <laughs> Galactica sponsored by Jet2. Where does a big scary monster sit on the train? I don't know. Where does a big scary monster sit on the train? Anywhere he likes. So we're just heading to Dark Forest, Holly. We've just come to check on Spike for the last time this season. He's not grown. I hope he's still going to be there next season. <laughs> yeah. Have you seen all this though? All the lighting in the trees. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah. It's all nice little different colour lights in the trees. Yeah. It'd be nice when it's completely dark, yeah. won't it? Yeah. It's a bit of behind the scenes for the fireworks. This is where they launch them all from. Cool, isn't it? Look, they're just setting them all up over there. See all the debris from last night, look all over the floor. <laughs> Where are we off to? 13. 13. I like 13 now. Yeah, you do like it, don't you? Is it your favourite? No, Wicker Man here. Is it your favourite ride in Dark Forest? Uh, yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> you're not really a fan of Rita anymore, are you? It's my second favourite ride here, though. Oh, right. But my favourite is Wicker Man. If you've watched the channel for a while, Holly used to hate 13 since Festival of Thrills last year, when 13 yeah. had the actors outside. Was it last year? It, oh, yeah. yeah, last year. Festival of Thrills last because year. Because it's yeah. end it's, of the year now. Yeah, and we had the smaller takeover this year, yeah. didn't we? So you were happy with that, weren't you? Because you didn't have the 13 girl. I wanted around. to be Wicker Man takeover now. No, we don't need a takeover, we just need normal. We need a Wicker Man takeover. <laughs> <laughs> Two Ninja Turtles going on 13. You ready for this, Mike? You're not going alone, are you? <laughs> How was your ride on 13? When we 
uh, get out the uh, tunnel, yeah. I'm like, are we going to launch? But it's always on two trains now, when it's on one train. You like launching back into yeah. the station, don't you? Yeah. It's it's quite, launch is quite... It was nearly a, not a night ride, wasn't it? It was quite dark. Yeah. It's like a bit of a dusk ride. But yeah, it was quite dark in the forest, wasn't it? So yeah, I rode with Monet, Madison's daddy, and he'd never, never been on it before. And yeah, so he, and he didn't know what the surprise was. So that was really good. It's very rare you get people now nowadays that don't and know Madison what happens. said, hello, Dabby. And then I turned around and you were there. So I went, hello, <laughs> Yeah, we were sat together behind you. So where are we going now? We're going back to the hospitality suite, aren't we? For yeah. some food. And so, yeah. hungry. I'm hungry as well. I'm excited to get warm in there because it's quite cold and wet and soggy but now. I'm isn't feeling it? a bit warmer. It's not really raining that much. Yeah, but I'm cold though. Cold, soggy and wet. Yeah. I'm looking forward to getting in there and getting some warm food down there. And you just take all your coats and puntos off and you're all in dry. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we like this hospitality suite, don't we? Yeah. It's cool. So we're back in the hospitality suite. I've kept my glasses on and I've all steamed up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's how warm it is in here. But yeah, the food smells lovely. Let's get check it out. Look at this, Holly. So you've got gammon. You having some gammon? Ah, that looks lovely. Thank you. And some gravy, some Yorkshire pudding. Oh, there looks like some stew here. Holly, can you put me some stew on? Because I'm trying to film as well, just to check it all out. Yeah, please. Not on my gammon, next to it. That's it. Lovely. Thank you. And some carrots, please. Oh, they look nice as well. Thank you. Lovely. Oops. Thank you. Can I have some of them little taters, Holly, please? Yep. Thank you. I want some corn, please. It's really nice. They're just getting another joint of gammon out as well now. This looks incredible. This is what Mike from Love to Explore has got for his dinner. Oh, he stitched me right up. It looks lovely, mate, doesn't it? Does this food look good? It's good. It's it's very tasty actually as well. I've started tucking in. Those carrots are amazing. Slow roasted carrots, I think they are. Very nice. Did you have some carrots, Holly? Just some sweet corn sausage. <laughs> Not always. They always use my phone. I think I've said that a million times now. Hey, we've got. We've got, we've got two disco men. Yes, Stacey says she don't like it. She said it reminds her of Slinky. Look behind you, Holly. Holly? All the bit of fight. Saturday night's alright. This is crazy. You can have a high five, Holly? <laughs> he want... <laughs> Maybe. He wants some Holly. Oh, uh, I can't eat. Oh, let's give it a go anyway. <laughs> <laughs> that could get messy. So yeah, I've got this chocolate orange cheesecake s'mores muffin type thing and a sticky toffee pudding. Not that I'm a fat getter, right? but I just fancied two puddings. Are you having two puddings, Mike? I might, I don't know, you could have to. <laughs> I think you, you can. Going back seconds on the meal as well. Every time, this light on Holly, every time I put the camera on her, her face is like white. But Holly's just had an, a bowl of custard. Or should I say a plate of custard. But there's no bowl with. There aren't any bowls, no. But this is very good, isn't it? I'm really impressed. Are you impressed, Mummy? So I'm just eating my pudding and I've got this chap sat next to me. How are you, all right? Blowing kisses. Very good. And now he's going to drink mummy's beer. This one? Ah, oh, you can't do it. It's a shame. Oh, he's crying. <laughs> no beer for disco ball. <laughs> Jack, it's her gone in here. Oh, definitely, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's have a look, Paris. Awesome. It suits you. 
you're gonna look amazing when you go out there in the fireworks. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we're just getting ready to go out to fireworks. And what you got, Holly? A sword. It's a light up sword, yeah. Honestly, this big bang thing just keeps on giving. So now you've got a free light up sword. Let's have a look then, get it out. Has it been a fun event so far then? Very fun, mate, yeah. And now Holly's got a light up sword for free. I'm gonna say one thing. When, when the fireworks are on, turn it off. Yeah, please. <laughs> Let's have a look. How do you turn it off? Wow, let's have a look, Holly. <laughs> oh, that's cool, isn't it? So good. This is awesome, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Aren't they cool? Where's your flashing sword, Mike? Save it for later. Oh. <laughs> Jake's got one as well. <laughs> Don't get them tangled up. <laughs> you like that, don't you? So we're just walking now to the VIP area, viewing area. See if it's a better view than last night on the lawns, right? I think it will be. Should be. I think it's at the front. The other way. So yeah, it looks like we're going to be right at the front. There's a stage there. Yeah. Excited. You just like your flashing little lights you've got, don't you? <laughs> oh god, it's took it all out of focus. <laughs> it's time for the Ultimate Fireworks Spectacular 2023. It's the moment you've been waiting for. It's time for the Ultimate Fireworks Spectacular 2023. And now, it's time for a story. From the day that Alton Towers was created, it has been telling stories for all who venture to this enchanted land. Stories of malevolent trees reclaiming the forest, space travelers sailing to the stars, and wooden men roaring fire. And tonight, there is the most magical story of all to be told. That could only be lived. It is the story of today. The story of you.
exploring. <laughs> so <laughs> you've made it to Katanga as the heart of the Kenyan You really and feel it go through. Oh, Opera explosion. Holly, how awesome was that? <laughs> that explosion. So good. <laughs> so good. to the Laughter Laboratory. It's time to receive your daily dose of ministry Hello. and joy. You like this bit? I love these. You That's love this amazing. bit, don't you? Yeah. yeah.
emotional, wasn't it? Like, I, I, I well, almost. Oh. Oh, when your story goes on, Alton Towers will always be here. Waiting for you to return to this world. And write your next chapter. So good, wasn't it? So good. So, Holly, initial reactions from fireworks? Fabulous. Fabulous, wasn't it? What was your favourite bit? Curse the curse. My favourite's Mutiny Bay because of those cannons. Me and Dan were just saying yeah. the gunpowder they must have used in that. The explosions are so loud. It's not really the fireworks of the curse, it's all the lasers. Yeah. Because there's the figure of her and then there's letters that say play. I know, but I don't think I saw that last night. I don't think I, I saw those things in the I water the, last night. I saw the girl, I think. Yeah, I saw the shadow, the, the demon shadow come up. They're like yeah, it does in the ride. That's so cool. No, I saw the girl, not the demon. Safety, if you're going to be going yeah. back to the tent. Did you get emotional? <laughs> did it make yes. you ever, It did me. When it said Alton Towers, it'll be here for you to write your next chapter, because that's what we'll be doing next year, won't we? Writing our next chapter of the channel. Yeah. Hey, mummy. What did you think of the fireworks? Really good. Very good, weren't they? Did you think it was different to last night? Uh, I saw a bit more, I think. I think, yeah, I don't know if it's because of where we were stood. I think because where we stood, we stood, you could see the images on the water that they uh, projected on there. Because they projected like the curse stuff. That curse stuff was fantastic. I think I missed a bit of it on footage because I was just that shocked. But, yeah. You really love these spinny things, eh? <laughs> Mike, yeah, the lighting's fantastic, can mate. Seriously, I can see, I can, I can see your turtles. Can you take me seriously with this hat? Right? Yes, yeah. I can. Absolutely. Thoughts on the fireworks? Um, it was good. It wasn't bad. It wasn't great. They started the show by saying there's a story, <laughs> then didn't have one. <laughs> but it was a good display because they had drones last year. Everyone was saying, weren't they? They're going to have more drones this year. They might do drones tomorrow for Nemesis. Or something. No, there's going to be no drones, mate. But <laughs> can you just confirm? Better than last year or not as good as last year? Not as good as last year, but you got the filler ones, so the big ones seem good. They can't knock out the bucket. Yeah, it was a 14th anniversary. It Mutiny Bay cannons, what did you think to them? I thought it was great yes. because uh, Steve had been here yeah. yesterday. There's a big yeah. explosion, Ooh. which he's going to show you on there. Who want to go to either X Sector or the Dark Forest, please remain on the front lawns. We can't reopen either area until we have checked for firework debris. Your safety has to come first. We'll keep you informed of our progress. Thank you. Yeah, I did ask him off that bit. Was that meant to happen or just went there something go wrong? Yeah, Dan thought something had gone wrong, but yeah. there were them booms yesterday. So. No, it was, it was after those booms yeah. where it has to see all these fireworks kind of... Yeah, yeah. So we've just come back to the hospitality suite for soup and bread rolls, Holly. Oh, Holly's not having soup. She's just having a bread roll. Why does soup in a cup? Soup in a cup, yeah. It's all right. Cream of tomato as well. Just keep on giving. Yeah. That's what, that's right, Mark. They do keep on giving. It's very nice. Hey Holly. So we've had our soup. Another drink. Where are we heading? Where are we heading to? Edmonton. 
Yeah, we're gonna go for a quick night ride on Oblivion. Hopefully get a Wicker Man ride in afterwards. We'll see. But Oblivion's only showing a five minute queue, so hopefully we can make it back in time to get on Wicker Man. And hopefully we don't get stuck at the top. Yeah, yeah, hopefully, yeah. That'd be a nice thing not to get stuck at the top, I have to say. <laughs> How was your ride on Oblivion? Good. Awesome, wasn't it? Yeah. So good. So good in the dark. Is that your first ever night ride on Oblivion? Is it? I'm not sure. I don't, I don't know if we did it last season. It's definitely the first one this season. It's been closed a lot, hasn't it? That was Cassia coming down. <laughs> Do it again. I've got my phone. What was yours, Paris? Yeah, I do like it. No, she's not going to do it. No. no. You're not going to give me the screen? No. Oh, my voice is hurting already from me. No. It's ridiculous. Awful. My face on that. Yes! <laughs> Holly's lost her sword to Ellie. Yeah. <laughs> You're a good oh. entertainer for Ellie, but, uh, for Holly, Ellie. I have to Ellie Alton. <laughs> she's found a new friend. Yes. <laughs> He's and she's jealous of your beanie hat. <laughs> I think she wants you. I, I, um, the bears took a photo of me with it on. Oh, really? <laughs> so it's like you had one then? <laughs> Get one next season. <laughs> <laughs> Last ride of the day. We come on. Let's go. We come on. How you doing, man? You're right. How awesome was the Wicker Man? Yeah. That was incredible, wasn't it? It's running so, so well. It's going so fast, isn't it? It was really, really fast. You rode with Emma, didn't you? I rode with Mummy. Mummy. <laughs> Mummy was screaming and holding on for dear life all the way around. Mummy's not keen on rides, is she? But yeah, she did ride the Wicker Man with us. I wasn't. I don't think she was prepared for how fast the Wicker Man runs at night when it's been running all day. She was really, really scared. Mummy was. Oh, the lights downstairs flash purple as well. It's cool. You check out the subterra light in the dark, Holly. Do you remember when the phalanx man told us that that light's up? No one really knew. And you could just see faintly the lights in the background. But it does look really cool. Control. Back with Vengeance 2024. Yeah. Here we are, is where she's broken out, Holly. There she is. So cool, we've got all the searchlights on and everything.
last night they had all the smoke going on here as well, didn't they? That made it more atmospheric. And obviously with the phalanx stood here, but they've obviously finished work now, so. the end of our day at Bolton Towers Fireworks Spectacular 2023. How awesome has that day been? Amazing. Amazing, hasn't it? It's been yeah. such a fun day. We have been so lucky to be gifted the Big Bang experience. That That's was amazing. Sweet. I think that that package, although it's expensive, I think it's £140 a person, I think it's really good value for money. To, for what it is, you get the fast tracks, you get the meals. Okay. You get photo passes, you get lanyards, you get pot badges. There's just so much and you get free drinks, beers, uh, wine. There's just, yeah, it's just endless to be honest, the I amount thought, of things. I thought she was going round there. Yeah, it sounds a bit like when she was going round. Yeah, it's like she's going to come and attack us, so we better be quick. So yeah, um, <laughs> really recommend the Big Bang. If you can afford it and, uh, you know, it's, if you're coming for a special treat, it's definitely worth doing for sure. Um, but the fireworks, what do you think to the display? Amazing. Yeah, yeah. I love the curse. The curse bit was good, wasn't it? My favourite was Mutiny Bay. I think yeah, that big cannon great. at the bottom was just amazing. Yeah, right at the end I of like the I like the lasers, how they like sea. Yeah, and how it looks like the sea. So that's really good. Alton Towers just do fireworks. Absolutely incredible. Um, I do think that last year's show was better, but that doesn't yeah. take away from what this year's show is because it's still amazing. Still one of the best, best, best fireworks shows yeah. you'll ever see, to be honest. Alton Towers do fireworks, amazing. So yeah, we've got on quite a few rides today as well, haven't we? Yeah. It's been a bit miserable weather, but yeah, you get your ponchos as well, don't you, with that yeah, um, Big Bang thing. So we've had ponchos and kept dry. So yeah, overall, really, really fun day. Bit sad that this is the end of the season now. Um, but when we come back, this beast is going to be back behind us. And that is going to be, yeah, we're back um, next week for Alton Towers one, but this is the end of the, the main season, isn't it? So, um, so yeah, this is the end of Alton Towers main season, but we are back for Alton Towers run next week. I'm doing the 10K, Holly's doing the child run, aren't you, through CBs? Yeah, we don't even know so, yeah. what I'm doing. <laughs> we don't really, it's not really clear, but she's signed up for the child's run. So yeah, stay tuned to the channel for that. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> Holly's a bit delirious, but yeah, we'll see you again soon, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.